how to fix the error. Your account has been disabled in the App Store and iTunes on your iPhone. So there could be a number of things that's causing uh, this error depending on what you have done. So if you have uh, been trying to uh, avoid putting in credit card details or payment details uh, from your iTunes accounts, you probably um, do a number of things and this may cause uh, the error message to pop up, uh, pop up like this. So you may be able to go into settings, go into iTunes, and you may be able to sign in okay. However, even after sign in, when you try to go to the App Store and download something, and that is when an error kind of comes up and saying that your account has been disabled in the iTunes Store. So while your Apple ID may not may or may not be locked, uh, you still get an error. So depending on what you have done and uh, what you did that's causing the error. So the first thing you want to uh, try is if you have uh, accidentally put in the, the wrong password or the wrong username uh, too many times, then uh, Apple have a security that basically stops people from trying too many times and will lock the account temporarily for one day or so two days. So you may want to wait out for a day or two and then try again. Now, you may not have a patient to wait. If you do not have the patient to wait, what you can do is you can uh, launch your web browser and then go to a website called iforgot.apple.com and if you put in your Apple ID, for example, put in your Apple ID, and then basically you uh, go to the next page so uh, tap on continued so I'm just making mistakes right there and then tap on the continue button and it goes to the next site uh, next page and then basically you can just follow the instruction on uh, from the site and then you try to recover your account so say so select how you want to unlock your account and you can tap on continue and then uh, from there you can try to uh, recover your Apple ID uh, and your username and the password. So that is one of the way you can try to uh, get your Apple ID back or get your account back into a good uh, working order. Once you do that, you can uh, sign into iTunes and once you have signed into iTunes, you can try to go to the payments uh, section and then uh, make sure you put in the correct payment details. Now, if all that fail, if it doesn't work, if you try the um, forgot password and it doesn't work, what you can do next is uh, go to this site here. So you want to go to the Apple support site. So I'll uh, include a link in the description for you. And basically you go to getsupport.apple.com website and in here uh, you need to uh, contact Apple support and in here you can talk to Apple support now. You can also schedule a call and there's other way you can also uh, contact Apples for more support. So it's got sketch code call, or you can have more options here, get help from Apple users around the world. So there's a number of different ways you can try to uh, uh, contact Apple support. Once you contact Apple support, uh, tell them that your account has been uh, disabled and they will uh, surely they will be able to help you to unlock your account. And from there you can uh, start to download uh, apps again. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.